What's up? It's Zach from OneSlashFat.com. Uh, thanks for coming by. Decided to do a video blog today because um, I'm talking about something specific that I want to get across this way instead of type it. Um, talking about injuries and holistic approach to recovery and handling injuries. Um, so you may have noticed I've been putting a lot more blog content lately on the website. So if you've been reading that, thank you so much. Um, I love writing, and it, but it takes time to do that stuff, so I appreciate everyone, and hopefully some of the stuff I've written has helped you out. So, um, anyways, so if you follow the blog or follow me on social media, you probably know that I have been dealing with some nagging injuries lately, um, namely my shoulder. Um, my I've been dealing with shoulder problems for a few months now. Um, and I've been getting massage therapy uh, from Diana. Hey, Diana. Diana. Uh, at Franklin Massage Center, if you're in the Nashville area, they're awesome. Robin is the owner. Uh, great people. They just got a award for best massage parlor in Nashville. So they're owned by the Dave Ramsey Building in Cool Springs. So definitely check them out. Anyways, um, so I've been dealing with some different stuff, mainly in my back and my shoulders. And... Uh, so a couple weeks ago, um, I actually started having an issue with my leg. Um, and none, honestly, none of this was a big shock or surprise to me. I've been working out really hard since 2011 when I started losing all my weight and got really into fitness. Um, the fact that it took this long for me to start having these injuries, especially playing hockey, working out four or five, six days a week, um, it's, not, it's, it's not a shock. So I'm not like bummed out about it. Um, I was talking to Ashley, one of our fellow trainers at Life Fitness Academy today, and she pointed out to me that I should actually be more thankful it happened now and not when I was trying to lose my weight because it could have been really discouraging to me as opposed to now when I know how to handle it. I know how to keep my weight off so I don't gain any weight while I can't exercise as hard. And Anyways, so I started dealing with this issue in my leg, um, which I love working out my legs if you know me. Um, I use my legs and hips for hockey a lot, and I, you know, most guys ignore their legs, so I don't. I love working out my legs. Um, so, uh, so anyways, I, uh, I started feeling this really weird pain in my inner thigh, and um, it was real sharp sometimes when I walk, and only hit every now and then. Not a big deal. I was like, whatever, it'll be fine. It started getting progressively worse to the point where. I woke up one morning and I literally could not walk. Um, I took one step and put pressure on my leg and hit the ground immediately. Uh, I was on crutches for like a day and a half. I spoke to Terry, the owner of Life Fitness Academy and my mentor, um, and he said, go see Dr. Chad, who's our chiropractor we work with at the gym and Terry's best friend, who I've been refusing to go see, which I'll kind of get into here in a second. Um, so I went and saw a primary care physician, um, found out I had hip inflammation um, in my sacralitis joint right there in my hip. And of course, he wanted to put me on meds, muscle relaxers, all this stuff. I was like, no, don't want to do that. Um, so I started just focusing on eating a lot of anti-inflammatory foods um, and did take, which was a lot of fruits, high uh, nutrient-dense greens, all that. Um, and, uh, I did take one supplement. I started taking a garden of life, the one supplement brand you'll hear me recommend cause they're whole food based. And, uh, I took their, um, I started taking their joint and anti-inflammatory supplement and it helped out greatly. So thanks to those guys for making a great product. Um, so anyways, it's feeling a lot better now. I'm not dealing with that issue anymore. Um, but while I was dealing with that issue, uh, I'm not drinking liquor, by the way. This is my water bottle. I just use an old vodka bottle. I don't like it. This kind of sticker on it. Um, anyways, so while that was going on, um, I wasn't working on my legs very hard. And last Monday, I was doing a light workout in this room. I'm in my home gym. And... Uh, I was on that pull-up bar, and I was at the top of a pull-up in the morning, and I just heard a, and felt a pop right here in my back, and uh, I thought 
what I thought had happened was that the uh, my lat finally just gave out and I strained a muscle. Um, I came down, I laid on the ground in a lot of pain. Um, I got the foam roller out, started messing with it. Um, I hit Terry up. I said, hey, man, I'm freaking out like this happened. And uh, he said, go see Dr. Chad. So I finally decided to do that. And oh my gosh, why did I not do it sooner? Um, I'll just be honest with you. One part to holistic fitness and holistic health that I've been really sketch on is seeing a chiropractor. Um, I've been really worried that it's just one of those things where like once you go, you have to keep going, which I've found out is kind of the case. Um, but I just didn't really believe in it and I didn't want to give it a chance. Um, I wish I had done it sooner, to be honest with you. Um, like I said, Dr. Chad's like Terry's best friend. He's someone that I can trust, and he's awesome. Um, he ran some tests on me, did x-rays, and we found out, which is what I was worried about, was that from Terry talking to me, that um, I, from carrying around so much extra weight for most of my life, 26 years, um, I totally shifted my structure when I started losing the weight and because I carried around that weight for a long time, I actually have like degeneration in my joint, in my, in my disc. So, um, what this ended up being was not a muscle strain, but I actually have a bulging disc in my back, um, which sucks, but I'll be honest with you. Well, I'll get into that in a second. Um, the most amazing things about my x-rays was I found out with my shoulder that's been bothering me that actually my left, like say this is my left shoulder and this is my right shoulder. My left shoulder is actually sitting about that much higher than my right shoulder. Same thing with my hips. So my right hip, my left hip. My right hip, which is the one that was hurt, is seen, was riding about that much higher. So I'm just all out of whack. I'm all out of line. Um... And that's what caused the bulging disc in my back. Um, so when I went back the next day, found out I had the bulging disc and everything, um, Dr. Chad, he said, okay, you're gonna, we're gonna start doing adjustments and I'm gonna get everything back into place. Um, so I had my first adjustment, um, you know, where he popped me and all that stuff all over the place. Um, it was an experience to say the least, but I will tell you, I felt a hundred times better after that. I had my second one today, um, and I mean, I feel awesome. Like, I couldn't even turn my head like this after the first visit, and now I'm like, like, that hurts, but I can, it's not that bad. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel a lot better. Um, my disc is feeling better. He told me that I'll probably be able to play hockey this weekend, which shocked me. I thought when I heard bulging disc, I was like, man, I'm probably out for the season, but that's not the, and I mean, I feel a lot better. Um, I'm probably only a few days away. I'm getting another adjustment Wednesday, and probably after that, I'll probably be able to start getting back into light workouts again. Um, I mean, I'm feeling really good. Uh, so I say all this to say that uh, chiropractic work has been amazing. In just a couple times I've done it, um, if you're worried about seeing a chiropractor, I understand, but I highly recommend it, especially if you um, have lost a lot of weight. Um, your structure is going to change. Um, you know, I mean, my posture has changed a lot. Like, I used to slump over really bad, and I'm kind of doing it now because I've been dealing with this issue, but... You know, I find myself having to stand up straight, sit up straighter, but um, I'm finding out why. It's because I'm just structurally damaged, and, uh, you know, he told me that after, here in about a month or so, he's going to take x-rays again just to show me how everything is, like, setting back into place. Um, you know, I'm probably, because of the stuff I've done and because of the weight I used to carry, I'm probably a chiropractic customer for the rest of my life. Um, I won't have to go as often um, once I get everything set. I may have to go once a month, once every couple months um, to get an adjustment. But, I mean, I can tell you just after doing it a few times and 
understand and talking to other people who've seen Dr. Chad and talking to everyone at the gym, like it works, you know, and I can already feel a difference. So, um, this combined with massage therapy, I'm seeing Diana again on Thursday, um, to do some more deep tissue work, um, is so important for recovery and just keeping your body in good health. Um, and, uh, hopefully I can get over these injuries and, uh, start rocking again. I have a new class that I'm really excited to get going at Life Fitness Academy. Um, I don't want to reveal too much about now, um, but uh, I'm really excited about it and I have to get my body going first because it's going to be a pretty hardcore class. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much what I want to talk about. Um, hopefully I can get everything right soon because I really um, want to start doing some more videos and stuff and really start, you know, doing some more workouts and stuff for you guys, um, to put on the blog. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about. Uh, thanks for checking this out. Um, also I'm going to have more information coming out soon on my book. I'm really excited about it. Um, I, it's been a dream of mine to release a book forever. So I'm glad that I'm finally getting to do it. Um, just weighing on a few things, uh, final cover, introduction to get written, um, also, and it should be out really soon, hopefully by the end of the year. Um, so, uh, anywho, I am out. Maybe I can get my dog to some come say hey real quick. Guinness! Guinness! Come here. There he is. There he is. Whoop! Ooh, he hit the computer. Say hey, buddy. Hey. <laughs> Anyways. All right. Well, um, thanks for checking the blog out. Like I said, keep checking back. I'll let everyone know. Uh, keep everyone updated on how I'm doing. Um, and again, I appreciate you coming by. Peace.